All right, in this video, I'm going to show you guys how you can create a website by using their website builder. All right, and I'm going to go through, like I said, I'll go through all these and show you guys how you can use them to your benefit. Now, most of this is going to be self explanatory, but I'll go on through it with you anyway. Um, I haven't really used this method, so it's going to be like my first time actually looking at it with you guys. Um, but for the most part, you can actually tell what how they look like and what you can do to actually make it look better. So what we'll do is we'll do business and just see what what options they have. Cause for overall, you're actually gonna need a professional website, but more so something that you can actually have as a landing page or capture page. You need them to capture it. Okay. So let's see what this one looks like. Right, this actually isn't a bad looking site. So if you want to, you can actually go through and get that. Or you can get the resume. Or you can go through all of these, like I said, and see. Now, me personally, I don't actually like any of these. Um, maybe yeah, because I, I don't like that. I'm not seeing the actual place to put your information in. Now, you can use this one. I like this one. I actually would we'll use this one. Um, you can select that, for example. All right. And you really want to take your time when you're setting up any kind of website, whether you're doing it the template, whether you're using WordPress, or whether you're using it doing it by hand. You want to make sure that you take your time because this represents who you are and what it is you are presenting to people. Okay. So what you, of course, you'll you see you can edit this right here. So to not say portfolio, we can say MCA auto benefits okay and then you can of course change this picture you can change these text and you can also add a form and this is what we actually are looking for right here you can also add this form right over here now what I would do is I probably would take off all this extra information and then insert the form right there but um, let me see I'll probably hit delete on that, delete on that, delete on that, delete on that, delete, and then put the form right here, and then just, you know, just edit it, make it look nice, make it look decent, okay, and you can put this form up here if you want, or this information up here, you can move this down here. Like you can do a lot with this. You can come here and, and edit this. You see that? Double click on it, upload the picture, and you go put the URL for the picture. So it's this part is really, 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 really simple. Okay. Then you can also, if you don't want to do that, or you can also check to see what they look like on different, different, um, different devices. Okay. So uh, let's say if you want to go. This one you can put YouTube channel, your gallery pictures, all of this stuff. You can actually put all of this right here. Now, if you don't want to do that, you go ahead and you can save this draft. Go back to the C panel. Now, if you do want to go with that, go ahead and, and go through it, edit it as much as you need, and then hit publish. Then you're gonna check and see what it looks like. Now, of course, your website link will be right over here. So say we go to build website. This will be a website link right here. So if I click on that, right click on it, it's going to show me this right here. Okay, but of course there's nothing up here yet because I haven't done anything. So, but once you publish that and it looks like this, you can add your extra information, all that stuff, then it's going to really, really pop. Okay? Um, and that's that way. And also, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go ahead and close this one out so that you guys can try and mess around with that and see if you like it. And if you do, then move forward with it. And then if you don't, you'll check out my next video and I'll show you how to do it using WordPress.